Hello everyone, welcome back to our tutorial for Adobe Illustrator. I'm Shane from IT Society. So today, we're going to talk about the pen tool and the pencil tool in the Adobe Illustrator. So first, we are going to walk through this basic of these two tools. Uh, we're going to go with the pen tool. And here, you can see the pen tool or we can click the shortcut key P for it. So once we click it, you can see our cursor become pen tool cursor. So the pen tool in Illustrator is quite different with the pen we see in other software. But this pen tool is drawing by the point. So for example, I like to draw a line. So I select the pen tool here. Then click on the canvas to add the first Point. Okay, so the first, first point is created. So I click on another point to create the next point for the third point also. So if we want to end the line, we should press the escape on the keyboard. So once we press escape on the keyboard, the line will be ended. So we can also use the pen tool to draw a shape. Let's say you want to draw a polygon. So we may start the point. So we want to close the shape, we may point the last point to the starting point of the shape Then you can see the pen cursor down there will appear one small circle This means that we are going to close the shape So click and we can find that this shape has been created So we can also draw a curve line using the pen tool Just simply click and drag So the next will be the curve line And we click and drag also so the one curve line is created. So if you want to end the line, same with the line just now, press escape. Then this curve line will be created. And also we can create a curve circle or oval using the pen tool as well. Just like this, click and drag, create the first line. And click and drag, create the second point. Then now, when the circles appear, click and drag, there's an oval being created. So let's go to the pencil tool. That it all. So the pencil tool in Illustrator is basically same with the pen we see in the other software which we can draw directly on the canvas and now the pencil tool is here or we can press N for the shortcut key So once we press N, you can see the cursor becomes the pencil tool cursor We can set up our setting of pencil tool by double click the pencil tool icon So double click it, so you can see this option pop up So by default, the setting will be at the middle here because I'm using a mouse to draw, so I will prefer to let it be smooth a bit. So put it to a smooth, click OK. Then you see we can draw a smooth line. So let's see if the setting is at the middle. It might be slightly different. Okay, not only the lines, we can create a shape using the pencil tool also. Let's say we are drawing a close shape. When you close the line, just like the pen tool do, you have a small spot circle appear at the cursor. And when, once we release it, when we see this small circle, it will become a full shape. So for the pencil tool, we can change the pattern as we like. So now, if you have a brush panel on your workspace, you are good to go. But if you are not, you could navigate to the window and check the brush here. Okay, once we uncheck, it disappear and once we check, it will appear again. Then you can go to the brush panel. There's a few kinds of brush is ready here. So let's say we choose one of it, and you see the pattern is now became the brush we have here. So we can also create a new brush pattern on our own. So let's select the one kind of a brush here and we select the pencil tool. We draw the line change it to the pattern we want to the selection tool select all of this press shift and click on this to select so now we select a group of lines here and we change them to this so let's say I want to make this into our new brush click on the setting here and see a new brush here select the art brush click OK select the directions select pin so click OK and now I can see the new brush is created here. When we draw with this, we will have a new brush like this. Okay, now let's use the pen tool and the pencil tool to create something. 
you may find a picture online or I'll attach the download link for this picture in the description below so first, you may adjust the opacity of this picture and here, you can see the transparency at the panel here you select the picture you can adjust the opacity maybe to 50 so that we can see our own drawing on the picture then, double click on the name to remain it as a background we then lock the layer like we do in the last video so now create a new layer for our drawing and now we are good to go so let's say you want to draw the wheel at here let's enlarge our window hold outer and scroll to zoom it you can see this wheel at here select the pen tool start drawing You may adjust the opacity of this shape also to let you see the background drawing. So we are done with the wheel here. So we have created a shape of the wheel right here according to the picture behind. And now this is how we use the pen tool in Illustrator usually. So for now let's go to the pencil tool. Normally we use pencil tool to add some elements on the pictures. So now unlock the background layer, select the background, select the picture and Put it back the transparency to 100. Okay, lock the background again. Go to the layer tool. So let's say we want to create a cut outline for the dolphin at here. Now select the pencil. So now let's draw an outline for this dolphin. Release when we see the small circle. And now we have an outline for it. Go to the selection tool. We may change the stroke color at here, this one we want to put white. Double tap on the setting and you see the dash line here, check the dash line. So now set the dash and the gap here. So let's say you want to set both of them to 10. Then set the weight of the line to let's say 5. You can see the cut on line for the dotting is created. Beside the cut on line, we can create a dotted line using the pencil tool also. So now go back to the pencil tool. Let's say I want to create a dotted line around the wheel right here. So now draw around the wheel. Okay, now by default, the setting will be like just now with the dotted line. So now go to the stroke. Double tap. Now set a dash to zero now. By now, you will see the line become a very thin line because our cap is at the flat cap. So now we want to change the cap to the round cap. And you see, we have our dotted line here. So basically, the differences between the pen tool and the pencil tool is that the pen tool is more frequently used when we are using a mouse to draw on the illustrator. And the pen tool is more frequent to use when we have a drawing tablet or a stylus to draw. So, that's all for me for the pen tool and pencil tool in Illustrator. Hope you enjoyed this and thanks for watching.